MTS crew, what's going on? Welcome to Testimony Tuesday, y'all. God is so good. I have a young man here today um, that's going to give his testimony and um, talk about what he's doing now and, and um, you know, how, you know, God brought him through school. And, and uh, he's just a wonderful uh, uh, person. His name is Malik Justice Burkash. And I've been knowing him ever since he was a tiny baby. And now he's a fully grown, handsome young man, just as sweet as he wants to be. God is going to do some miraculous things in this young man's life because he loves life. He loves his community and he loves everybody. He doesn't have a mean bone in his body. And, and he even and keeps me encouraged and I you know I appreciate him so my daughter is his um godmother and I'm his I guess I could be his god grandmother right so uh, uh he's just here to just you know say hello and you know he wants to you know just say hello and you know meet the MTS crew so y'all yeah, want y'all to welcome Malik Rakash with love on Testimony Tuesday y'all crew what is going on y'all i hope it's all good in the neighborhood y'all y'all i have a special guest here i would love for y'all to meet i admire this young man i drive him when he was a baby so my daughter is his godmother and i am his god what Grandma. Grandma. <laughs> so I want you to meet him. I'm so proud of him. And uh, he's done a lot in his life. And I appreciate him and just love him. I love him. But I'm going to let him tell you about his life and what he's doing now. But first, we're going to pray. And I'm going to let him do the praying today. All right. All right. Mama T speaks. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you for all those who have gathered here today. May your love and blessings be in abide with all those watching and everyone in this home, the love and laughter and life that is just coming forth from this place is magnificent. And in your glorious name we pray, amen. Amen and amen. And uh, his name is uh, Justice Malik Brock. Rakash. Rakash. I just told him to say his last name. Rakash. So Malik, could you, and, oh, he's writing a book, y'all. So he's going to tell y'all about his book, and his book will come out when, what, when? Uh, the 22nd of this month. The 22nd of this month, and y'all have, y'all have got to get this book. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be inspirational. So please, y'all, buy his book, and I'll put the link and everything um after the video down below, okay? <laughs> okay, Malik, tell us something about your career and yourself. Okay, so like you were saying, I, I do have a book coming out, mm -hmm. A Man's Guide to Inspire, A Life of Love, oh. How You Network to Make Good Work, like mm -hmm. Mama T is mm -hmm. doing right now, speaking to you all. Mm -hmm. And um, it, it's uh, really a book that I wrote for my kids. Did you? Yeah. Your kids before you had before kids. Before I had them. He don't <laughs> have kids. So, so, so y'all, guess what he's doing? He's speaking things that's not as though they were. Mm -hmm. So, you know, sometimes we have to think ahead, you know, um, ahead of things. So mm -hmm. he's thinking ahead. Yeah, you know. Especially now, you know, 2020 was a hard year for a lot of people. Yes, yes it was. Yeah, and, and you know, it's just cranking up the heat every year. We, You know, there's something else and there are more and more distractions from what really matters. Yeah. Um, and I really want to give, you know, have like a testament to, you know, what I believe in, what mm -hmm. I want our family to value and, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. how to go in the right direction because mm -hmm. this life can be a roller coaster. <laughs> yeah, 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 it can be a roller coaster. It can. Okay. Well, how we can work together, mm -hmm. and how we all have these these roles. And if you start local and mm -hmm. think global, mm -hmm. then everything's going to work out for the best. For the best. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, um, uh, uh, you just graduated from school, and so where are you going from here with your schooling? Um, I'm actually pursuing my master's. Good. Um, That's yeah, wonderful. Uh, I'm going for two. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> He's a workaholic, y'all. <laughs> hey, you know, if you love what you do, it feels like you're not working at all. Yeah, so. yeah, 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 that's true. That's true. Um, so you're going for your for your master's. Mm -hmm. So you're in Kennesaw. You're going to Kennesaw, mm -hmm. and then you're going to where? Uh, Morehouse School of Medicine. Oh, okay. Um, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm just happy for you. I'm just. I'm, I'm, I mean, how does your future look? I know we don't know what's mm -hmm. going to happen in the future, but tell us your plans. My for the plan. Future. Mm -hmm. My plan is ultimately. I'm going to be pursuing a PhD mm -hmm. um, so that I can, you know, become a real, a real expert and a resource for my community and, you know, the people that look to me for advice. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm, I'm studying integrative biology mm -hmm. and uh, biotechnology and bioentrepreneurship. And, and, and where you were born. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I was born here in Atlanta. 
Mm -hmm. um, I'm a greedy baby. <laughs> <laughs> um, and my mom's actually from Morocco. Mm -hmm. um, and then she uh, migrated to the Netherlands. Mm -hmm. um, and so I've got family all in Europe, uh, Amsterdam, Spain, France. You everywhere. Know, you know. <laughs> everywhere. 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 Um, so I've, I've been very fortunate to have a global sort of upbringing. Mm -hmm. And I'm able to see the different cultures and perspectives mm -hmm. and their religions, as, you know, as they truly are. And, Mm -hmm. Most of the time, it just boils down to a couple things, mm -hmm. you know, love thy neighbor, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> love thy neighbor, love thy neighbor. Yeah, when you was um, a growing up as a little boy, we're talking to the young men now. When you were growing up as a little boy and you were in high school, did you ever go through a rough period in your life? Oh, definitely. You know, I struggled with, you know, my identity, you know, being, you know, someone from this variety of cultures and perspectives. Mm -hmm. It's easy to lose sight of, like, who you are and where your roots are, mm -hmm. right? And so... Um, just your, your roots you know support you and they keep you grounded mm -hmm. um and it's very important that you know you, you seek those out and you hold on to those because that's uh, it makes makes up who you are you know mm -hmm. we stand on the shoulders of giants yes yes we do yes we, do. <laughs> we, we, we honestly do malik i just appreciate you coming to our testimony we didn't say it we got to say welcome to testimony tuesday, welcome I forgot to testimony to... tuesday. <laughs> I forgot. but i'm just i'm just so proud of this young man and uh, um I, i've had a chance to see him from when he was a little arm baby up until now and um uh, he's a, a a good person and always willing to help you single i am single <laughs> <laughs> By choice, by choice. By choice. <laughs> so, you know, he's single, y'all. But, you know, <laughs> hey, you know, I appreciate you coming, Malik, and, and, you know, talking. If anything else you would like to share, you know, on this platform, you know, you're welcome to to uh, share now if you want to. Um, anything else you have? Um, well, it takes a village, right? And so we're all in this together. So eat local, you know, buy local, spend your money with people you care about mm -hmm. because you have a lot of purchasing power. Don't let anybody ever tell you differently and um, voting power. If you don't vote, please vote. Please mm -hmm. vote. <laughs> please. You are stronger than you, than, than you may know. Um, so, God bless you. <laughs> God bless you. Okay. Thank you, Malik. And so, you know what? Be good to yourself. And if you be good to yourself, you have no other choice but to be good to others. Look, Malik, <laughs> take this hand. Let me put it on my shoulder. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, you put it on this shoulder and pat yourself on the back. And you remember that you are the apple of God's eye. Every hair on your head has already been numbered. He knows who you are, where you are, where you're going, and what you're doing, boo. He knows you. He has your digits. So God bless, and you be good, and we'll see you later. Thank you, Malik. Thank you, Mama T. <laughs> you wake up early. Grit your teeth then head to a job or class you don't like. Maybe it's dull, or maybe your boss or teacher's a jerk, or maybe you just don't want to spend so much time and energy in an office or classroom. Do you feel tenaciously distracted by the world? Do you feel as though there's a lack of love today? Have you tried everything you can think of, but find yourself feeling more alone now than ever? It's okay but you can't imagine ever making enough to retire by 40, put your kids through college, or find happiness. I'm Justice Prakash, and until I started writing my first book, A Life of Love, five years ago, my life was a lot like yours. Today, I work when I want. I plan to live in the world of my dreams, and I'm a steward of love. Since this book, I found other ways to heal the world I'm also going to create multiple world-changing businesses. What I've discovered in the process is that there's a ton of love to be shared with the world, if you know what you're looking for. That's why I've created a man's guide to inspire, a life of love. How will you network to make good work? In it, I teach you how to widen your perspective and show you how to love yourself and others. We're all in this together. You're not alone. For instance, you'll learn my top secret strategies for unlocking forgotten power that gives you the motivation to keep going. Once you uncover obstacles in your life, you can see the guardians that surround you. I'll teach you how to switch your focus and appreciate what you have. I'll also teach you how to ask the right questions to start producing quality relationships in your life. 
so that you can avoid all the usual heartaches romantic space when you're looking for potential partners or friends plus you learn a foolproof method for connecting to the self it's just a small fraction of what you'll learn in my book it covers so much more this book widens your perspective and teaches you how to love yourself and others we're all in this together you're not alone don't continue to suffer at a job or class you don't like for a paycheck or diploma that's never going to make you rich. Head to justiceprakash.com right now to learn how you can build a very successful life of love.